Instructors know, have experience where their students can and cannot do uh, from their previous teaching experience. And um, I would bet that they would have identified areas. For example, my subject area is physics, and so what I've heard and what I've experienced as an instructor is the students don't know the math. They're not prepared with the math. They can't do basic uh, high school algebra and here they're in a calculus-based course, among other issues that have been researched in the physics education literature. So there's, um, I would say, an unspoken or unspecified problem to be solved that maybe isn't or hasn't been articulated uh, by an individual instructor, but I'm pretty sure that it's there. So um, this is a, to be concerned about becoming an active instructor, um, is important to have to gain a responsibility and commitment to their own teaching profession and to their students of course knowing better studying the intellectual development of their students which can be quite rewarding and quite sobering sometimes but to see what what it is what is this animal that I have been frustrated with for so many years can I be part of the solution can my students be part of the solution so to learn from your students by this, um, to f form an atmosphere or to, with your students to provide one where they are more willing to say that I don't know if, if that's a problem. Um, and to inform your teaching in the future and share your results. What didn't work is, is as important to know as what did work. Well, that's not an easy question to answer globally across the disciplines and the specific cultures within the department, at least in the United States, that is very situation and campus specific within a, and even within a department, a discipline. Um, I can give some examples from my experience as a physics, physics education researcher and as a faculty in a physics department. Um, one is to become cognizant of literature on education. I would recommend that you look at something that's done specific in your discipline or as close as possible. And also seek out professors who have teach, taught uh, and what their impressions of making changes. Um, not, don't be discouraged, but why, how you should do it is to have an open mind and, and not plan to be a, a specialist in education research uh, and to seek information, both experts and colleagues and literature that makes sense to you, that you understand the language or you have resources to that, but speak to you as an, as an instructor. Mm -hmm.